As Derek mentioned, temperatures will be on the rise this weekend as the heat index will reach nearly 100 degrees. And with a festival starting in La Crosse County tonight, First News at 9's Dashiell Mensel shares how organizers plan to keep attendees safe in the heat. As temperatures rise this weekend, La Crosse Fire Department Community Risk Educator Molly McCormick says she wants the community to be prepared for the heat. One of the best ways to do that is to make sure that you're following along on like the National Weather Service's social media, their website, following along with your local news to make sure that you're aware of what's happening in our community and what's coming up in the next week. Events such as the Country Boom Music Festival will bring many people outside for the next few days, and McCormick says people need to be self-aware when outside. If you're going to be out in the heat, that you're staying hydrated, that you're wearing loose-fitting clothing, light clothing, light-colored clothing, these are all really simple things that we can do to better be equipped, to be better equipped for the heat. President and founder of Country Boom, John Holthouse, says the festival is taking precautions to make sure that everyone stays safe during the festival. One of the comforts we try to do is a lot of air conditioning pockets, whether it's indoors for eating, hanging out, bathrooms, air conditioned bathrooms, and lots of different pockets of shade as well, right? So if people are getting overheated or anything else, a lot of water stations, pushing hydrations, uh, a lot of those different type of things, just making sure people are being safe uh, with the rising temperatures. Heat exhaustion and heat stroke are some of the risks that come with being outside in hot temperatures. Make sure you're staying in tune with your body. If you're noticing excessive sweating, if you're dizzy, if you're feeling faint, um, those can all be signs of heat exhaustion. So it's really important that you pay attention to that and you take the break that's needed. In La Crosse, Dasha Menzel, First News at 9.